Hey guys, this is Rich from Rich TV Live, and I wanted to talk about Takashi 69 because it is literally trending everywhere. Takashi 69, what the latest charges could mean for the US rapper. Like this situation is crazy. So Takashi 69 is been like one of the hottest rappers for like the last year. Came out of nowhere, 22 year old kid. He gets approached by the FBI and they say to him that his life is in jeopardy. And his own manager, who he just recently fired, he fired his whole team because apparently they were taking money from him. Apparently his own manager was plotting to murder him or hurt him, physically assault him. And he even had a wire on him and they went to court and there was another lawyer that was sitting in the courts and this lawyer is getting famous. He's all over... Instagram and he's, he's making a name for himself because he was in the courts when this happened and he went out and he live streamed and talked about what happened and he was saying that 6 9 was sitting there with his head in his lap and praying when they were trying to convict him of all these charges and he is and his, his attorney is swearing that he is not guilty they are swearing that he is innocent look at this Takashi 69 is completely innocent of the several new charges he faces, claims his lawyer, who also reckons the gangster rapper is the victim. The, the gummo hitmaker is accused of carrying out armed robberies and organizing shootings of rivals as part of the Nine Trey Bloods gang. Takashi 69, real name Daniel Hernandez, is an admitted child sex offender and reportedly faces 32 years to life in prison if convicted of the new charges. But his lawyer, Lance Larazzo, La Lazaro, has launched a defense that paints 6 9 as someone only pretending to be a gangster to sell his music. Takashi 6 9 at risk in brutal New York prison. This is brutal. Apparently, the prison is very dangerous. Takashi 6 9 faces jail, sex offender registration after child porn offense. Daniel Hernandez is completely innocent of all charges being brought against him, Mr. Lazaro wrote in a statement cited by Rolling Stone. An entertainer who portrays a gangster image to promote his music does not make him a member of a criminal enterprise. Takashi 69 is not a member of Nine Trey Bloods, but hired members as his management and security, alleges the lawyer. Mr. Hernandez became victim of this enterprise and later took steps by firing employees and publicly denounced this enterprise through a morning show, Mr. Lazaro's statement claims. Threats were then made against his life, which resulted in this case being brought immediately. Four other men were arrested and charged with the Takashi 69 as part of a crackdown on the Nine Trey Bloods in a joint operation of the U.S. Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms, and Explosive, Homeland Security, and New York City Police. Meanwhile, Nicki Minaj who released a collaboration with Takashi 69 this year despite his pleading guilty to a 2015 sex crime involving a 13-year-old girl has taken to Instagram saying she's praying for him. I love you and I'm praying for you, your mother, daughter, and her mom during this time. The Anaconda hitmaker captioned an animated image that depicts Takashi 69 urinating a rainbow-colored liquid. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Takashi 69 was denied bail and is awaiting court proceeding behind bars in New York. Wow. Unbelievable news from instant star in like literally less than two years to now going to jail for 32 years to life in prison for racketeering and firearms charges. Now, on a crazy twist, Treyway, his ex-manager, was wearing a wire talking to other members of his own gang, talking about murdering Takashi 69, I guess for a plea bargain. And then the police went to the FBI went to Takashi 69 and told him that his life was in danger and offered him, I guess, some type of protection. He denied it. And then they picked him up the very next day. And now today he's in jail, he's in courts, and another lawyer is there and sees this whole thing go down and said that 
Takashi offered everything in his bank account, which was $1.7 million, for bail, and he was denied. And he was shivering and shaking and apparently almost crying, and he is scared for his life, for sure. And he's now in jail with everybody else, like a whole bunch of hardened criminals. And this is a 22-year-old kid that apparently isn't really a gangster and has just been pretending to be for his career. And his manager, his ex-manager, Shoddy, had $60,000 in his account. And that's pretty much what this other attorney has come up publicly by saying. He happened to just be in the same courtroom as Takashi 69 and Shoddy when all this went down. And he is coming out saying that he feels like the charges are frivolous and that they will be dropped so this is a crazy twist. This is trending everywhere. Smash the like button. Comment down below. This is your boy Rich bringing you the news first. What do you think about this? Takashi 69 do you think he will go free? Do you think he will spend 32 years to life in jail? Comment down below. Let me know what you think. Share this video everywhere. If you like this video, smash the like button. This is your boy Rich. This is some crazy news. Takashi 69 My kids listen to Takashi 69 I'll be honest with you. I like some of his music. I don't know what's going on here. I'm not behind the scenes. I'm just telling you guys what I've heard. What do you guys think? Let me know. I'm out. Peace.